Hello, Mr. Nigren here. So we're back in Total War 1942. I'm not sure if the Panthers will be back now because I said I would play this battle of Balik Papan in the Philippines, uh, where the United States of America is attacked by uh, Isoroku Yamamoto of Japan. Uh, I said I would play this battle the same day as the other episode, but that wasn't the case. Unfortunately, the game is shut down. I had it on uh, for a couple of hours while I, while I did other stuff, and all of a sudden the game had shut down when I returned to the computer. So now I'm worried that uh, the tanks and uh, such, uh, the two tanks might be bugged. So if they are and uh, do not have turrets, we might actually have to restart the entire campaign. Then I will not uh, probably record. Uh, until I start the Battle of France again, uh, or probably I will play the Battle of France and, uh, and then then I will start recording because I don't want the turrets to look bugged. Usually they do if we, if we load a saved game. We will see. Okay, let's fight the battle. We'll most likely lose it. The enemy win their battles from the air. They knock out my panzers with American armor-piercing shells. They conquered. The conquered mourns. The conqueror is undone. Field Marshal Erwin Romo. Force, we had some Corsairs here, otherwise just the infantry, the enemy army, yes, they had uh, working tanks uh, with turrets, good, I was worried they wouldn't have their turrets, because we loaded a safe game, but they haven't fought, so that's probably why they are still intact, very good, very good, okay, they also have some planes, they have the Seer of Fighters, and also they um, I think they had two zero fighter planes. Okay. Two units of zeros. Then they had their Utsu Renault Utsu tanks. They are better than the Renault. We can see they have a better like a turret or pipe or whatever. Uh, we have their jeeps here, their cars. By the way their general should have a sword, yeah, he has a sword in his hand. Okay. They have some artillery as well. Type 96 artillery. Some infantry. Grenadiers. The Japanese Empire. And, uh, more grenadiers. Right, a lot of grenadiers. Our troops have Corsair fighters. I believe they had better attack, we had better defense. They only had one better defense, they had two or four better attack. Then we have some infantry, we have the riflemen, grenadiers, assault infantry, more riflemen. The riflemen are the basic troops. Okay, we will group them. Loose formation. AI control. Uh, wait a second, we will have them in guard mode first and then AI control. And now, let's start the battle. We will probably lose like in history. The enemy had way better stuff here. Take 
course the buildings are in the way for the planes. Looks like the door. Uh, our infantry is being crafted. American infantry. By the way, oh do you? Yeah, it's it's fine. Craft our infantry. Dears of America have different look. Oh, here we have some riflemen of the Japanese Empire. These samurai looking. Uh, like, uh, hats. They've already taken down a few of our buildings in town. You see, they can fire at the buildings their um, Type 96 artillery these things and the mortars of course they have two artillery units pass only two other factions are more advanced these other main factions they won. We are foe that sups from this most foul cup. Took down our planes there. Clear defeat. The Japanese banner has been raised in the center of Alec Papen in the Philippines. Okay, clear defeat. Captain Ralph of the United States of America, the USA, deployed 973 men, killed 234 of the Japanese have 85 remaining. Suruki Yamamoto of the Japanese Empire, or the Empire of Japan, had 1,423 men, killed 888, and have 1,144 remaining. Okay, we're done with this battle. The raising of that flag on Suibachi means a marine corps for the next 500 years. James Forrestal, Secretary of the Navy, 23rd February 1945. Can a candidate for adoption, benefactor Franklin Roosevelt, okay. Um, richest faction, we are the richest faction in the world. That's good. Settlement occupied. Yeah, the Japanese took Balik Papen in the Philippines. End of turn report, we are minus 33,711, okay. Uh, a powerful fate. Or, or that was the expenditure. A yeah, powerful fate faces. Okay. <coughs> um, so we will just guard this area for now. There are no troops we can send there. Okay, let's go back to America for now. Maybe we should go to the area in Africa first. We have some troops that survived the battle. George Patton could be retreating. The troops could be left there to defend. We need to retreat towards the friendly port. Didn't reach there entirely this time. 
at least see the area. No more wind today, sire. You just need a ship there, so you can move over this arm and help Britain win here, help the Australians. Are part of the British Empire. Okay, um, what about uh, construction? We'll check construction. So in Panama, we go for some land clearance. In on air, we will also go for land uh, clearance, I believe. And in Mataram, and we're done. Recruitment done. and we can go for some riflemen. And in Reykjavik we can go for some uh, riflemen as well. them as a buffet or, or a wall against anyone in South America. Okay, let's just uh, end the turn, I think. Candidate for the option, sure. Don't need everyone in the same city. Every general in New York, wherever it is, in Washington maybe, can move on to New York. So General Peter Houston was moved to New York, and uh, James Davis will be moved to Boston. We'll keep. Franklin Roosevelt in Washington, that's our leader, he doesn't look anything like him because in this game we do not have heroes, we, we have uh, portraits and they are random. We could have uh, the correct portraits for some characters but not for all. Uh, this is based on uh, Rome to the War and Barbarian Invasion, not Alexander. Had it been based on Alexander we could have had unique heroes and such, but then the ships wouldn't have worked instead. The ones that Dagwax uh, wanted for historical battles. Okay, and custom battles. Uh, diplomatic information. The following factions are now at war with each other. French State Witch and the Italian Empire. Uh, so they have declared war on each other. And the following factions have broken their alliances. The Italian Empire and the Third Reich. Okay. Recruitment report. We have new troops. In Washington we have an anti-tank infantry unit. In Jacksonville we have a trooper. Ship. Uh, in uh, Chicago we have anti-aircraft truck, in Las Vegas we have a M7 Priest artillery, mobile artillery. Uh, in Panama we have a trooper ship, in uh, Batavia we have a Corsair unit, a unit of uh, fighters, Corsair fighter planes. In Mataran we have riflemen, in Palembang we have grenadiers, in Reykjavik we have riflemen. In Oniara we have a Corsair fighter planes and in Casablanca we have a Chester ship. And then we have a spy. Good, we will move the spy immediately. So there are two spies. Then we'll move one of the spies down towards South America, of course. Yes, sire. 
Tomorrow's journey this far. Yes, my lord. Oh, it's a diplomat, actually. Good. We'll move the spy as well. Hi. Hi. So we have a spy here. A wee break, then. Greetings, your majesty. Okay, end of turn report. Looked better. We were at minus. New family member, USA Clementine. Okay, construction report. We have a port in Washington and a barracks constructed in Reykjavik. Okay. Can move the ship. Should reach the port now. P uh, there were no port, but it should. Uh, Reach this area now. Yes, sir. We can move out the army finally. We'll move, uh, we will leave a unit of riflemen there. Yes. And move this fleet immediately. Actually, we'll leave the arm here for now. They can't really move there, I see. That's not good. Boarding the ships, my lord. Not good at all. We'll have to move them out of the ships in case Japan attacks at sea. We don't want the arm be, to be sunk. Japan has huge naval troops nearby. Britain too. This is a British fleet. They might betray us, we don't know. So we will take it carefully there. Japan might attack there as well. Here we have another British fleet, a huge one. So we move the George Patton towards New York. Good, we will move him out. Wasn't what I wanted. So, George Pat has reached this area. Peter Houston can be moved to Chicago. We have um, George Patton safe in New York. We'll of course keep them there until we have a new army. Uh, let's check our constructions. So we'll go for uh, paved roads. Actually, I think we'll go for military buildings first. An airstrip would be good. Because we know that the enemy will focus on uh, military buildings. We don't want to be underdeveloped. It would be too difficult. Okay, so we have land clearance we can uh, make in Reykjavik. Okay, we're done here. Okay, what about recruitment? We're in Reykjavik now. And we can recruit more troops. I think we'll go for a trooper there. Trooper ship. Panama, we can go for more troopers. Jacksonville, actually, can go for a trooper there too. In on the area, we'll go for Corsair fighter planes. Matter and we'll go for some riflemen. In Casablanca, we'll go for some riflemen. We'll need it if they attack. Reykjavik. Yeah, we're back there. Okay. Uh, so, we do not have an army ready. We're first building up huge fleets here. <coughs> 
Yes, my lord. Um, we might have some agents we could move. We'll check our agents. <coughs> we should have two diplomats. Yes, my lord. Another yes. diplomat in Casablanca, that's very good. <coughs> Let's move the diplomat here. So we can speak to the French state Vichy. What about ceasefire trade rights for now? They agreed. Good. So we have ceasefire with the French state Vichy. Which means we will delay their attack. They won't attack Casablanca immediately, which is good. Yes, my lord. We can move further to Tunis, held by the Third Reich. <coughs> we, call, we can speak to them too. Um, so, I believe when I play the Yum campaign, I would actually always force the, the map information. Because in 1942, I believe the map information was public knowledge. <coughs> We will uh, have map information. The Reich should have gotten that from Fra France too. We'll go back to them. <coughs> okay, and uh, map information. So now we have France on the map. Which France? Or the French state, which uh, and we also have Germany. If we zoom in on the map, we can see that Africa is mostly held by them. We also saw that in the first episode when I had the map visible. <coughs> but things can have sh can change. It's only been like one or two times. So. Here we have a huge Nazi fleet, a huge British fleet. information that they had about others like Hungary and uh, Romania and uh, Finland even Italy yeah. okay so we'll use the diplomat to move yes, my lord. Yes, down sir. towards Italy next we'll move to Tripoli and speak to Italy and then move to the free French and Britain we already have the free French and Britain on the map because they are Roman factions. Okay, so we need to move through those areas and up to Turkey and speak to them and the Soviet Union and others. And then we want to speak to people in South America as well uh, and uh, later in Asia. Okay, we can't do anything more this turn, so we'll click end turn. Candidate for adoption. Let's move him to Orleans. New Orleans. End of turn report. Looking good. Faction ad announcements. Okay. Construction report. We have new buildings. Recruitment report. We have troopers. Riflemen. Assault infantry. Okay. Basic stuff. troops again. So we wanted them to attack here, but they have cov uh, became covered and we moved down the army. Okay. Here we have an army too that we would want to move from that area. Shit. People's Republic. 
Republic of China having, having God's name. Did they take this area? Japan started with this area. Must have revolted the People's Republic of China. They are neutral. Mostly infantry. Sorry, but we can't allow that. I think we will attack the People's Republic of China then. If you do not like communists, the severe capitalists. Okay, so we will attack. Save the game before the battle. We only have infantry here anyway. Okay, let's fight the battle on the battle man. I wanted to fight the Japanese here. But we ended up fighting the People's Republic of China. They only have two starting areas, uh, one starting area. So this was surprising. Oh, we even have fl uh, fleets over there. Maybe they can help start deployment. I don't know. Maybe they are just visible. Because we have the fleet over there. That's cool in Rome to the War that we can see the fleet. If you have it nearby, look at that. Maybe they go actually add the fleet outside the playable area, I don't know. Or if it is our fleet. They can't really aid in the battle, unfortunately. That's cool. Looks like the same trips that we had, troopers. Can't move the camera over there, unfortunately. Okay, that was surprising. So we are attacking. <coughs> okay, tanks could be one group. If my tanks are broken or something, we'll take a look at them. Here we have the jeeps. They have their their um, drivers. Here we have the Shermans. and four Shermans. They didn't look broken. We have some Cunningham, T1 Cunninghams too. Good. Start the battle. The People's Republic of China, the communists in China. Okay, we will attack them. Our infantry. It's more fun that way. Also order our mortar to attack. To fire the wheel on. They will attack the buildings of the city most likely. We will terrorize the city with our mortars. <coughs> we are protecting the British here. We don't want the communists to take over the air either. Okay, and uh, our fighter planes could be one group. Loose formation. Loose formation on every unit. Could send our fighter planes to the center. Our infantry are moving in and our fighter planes. Look at 
that. It's explosions. Look at that. It's the grenadiers, I think. Yeah, I think they are throwing this grenade. Might have problems or issues with revolts in certain areas. Yeah, broken the Chinese infantry. They better start in China, but here they revolt as they had only. Fight is Soviet. We have no problem fighting the People's Republic of China during World War II. They were weak. They didn't have many allies. They were allied to the other Chinese faction. They only became allied to the Soviets after the war. The Civil War. <coughs> during the war, they were allied to the nationalists of China. Or the Republic of China. <coughs> so the American infantry is moving in. Hope we won't kill them with our own angry grenades. Could be bad. Actually, I don't uh, like the idea of them killing their own troops. We we'll stop them immediately. Same with the anti tank. Fighter planes. So they killed um, <coughs> 92 percent. They killed zero percent. The infantry sucks against planes and such. All right, an easy victory for the United States. They fired their proteons. I can't see any destroyed buildings. Let's move our infantry towards the center. We want to kill everyone. The American flag is now flying its center. That goes to only men of great virtue and valor. Clear victory. Your army, Douglas MacArthur. Oh, it's Douglas MacArthur's army. And we took this area good. British might actually attack us. 
If we leave a garrison here too weak. So we took Hollandia. Let's exterminate the populations, they won't revolt. <coughs> That's done to prevent revolts. Not because America used to exterminate or anything. Okay. <coughs> we'll go for an airstrip here. Pat blocked Admiral Arthur. <coughs> War. United States of America and the People's Republic of China. Continue expand. Douglas MacArthur. Resistance is futile. Hollandia. I don't know if Japan has any troops here. Like they used to. Uh, the British fleet over here. They are dangerous. <coughs> Would like to move the fle fleet here. You can move this army. Leave Douglas MacArthur in this area for now. Ah, uh, here we have the Japanese army. They are still here. Under General Sachio Higashiyama. Higashiyama. Then we need to defeat them. Might wait one turn with that. Have another army here. Right. Alt Utsu and the general Takashire Goto. the other army. Maybe we can go to the uh, offensive against Kuala Lumpur. <coughs> that would be good. So the British have an area over here. Five units. They might have armies here too somewhere. We want to handle the Japanese. Click on an item in the proposal. Okay. A balanced or very generous treaty proposal. Uh, we can likely. leave a diplomat here in case they ever declare war on us. But uh, no, we will continue to move for now. Yes, sir. We want a diplomat. Tomorrow's there. journey planned out, sir. Do they have their own diplomat? Here we have our spy, female spy. Okay. In, in Africa, we can also move the diplomat there. Your orders, sire. We move to triple the next. Yes, sire. Approaching their speak to the Italian Empire. Listed offer and demand items to create we want a map information. Let's an item in the proposal to we will give them map information. A balanced as well. or very generous treaty proposal. Okay, so now we have Italy on the map. All three areas in Africa. And Mogadishu is under siege by the British. And Addis Ababa is also under siege by the British. The British are aggressive in this campaign. And they are also besieging the Vichy French in Damascus. So the Brit Britain is really aggressive. Okay. Can continue yes, to move 
the diplomat. Speak to Britain next. Have you already had everything you wanted there? Let's yes, continue sir. towards the free French. Now it's time to construct and recruit. Start in Washington. <coughs> so we'll go for barracks in Panama. Jacksonville. I think we'll go for s a sandbag wall. Chicago will also go for a sandbag wall. And New Orleans, a sandbag wall. And Dallas as well. And in Denver. And in Las Vegas. In Los Angeles. Seattle. And barracks in Monera. In Matran we'll go for barracks. In Batavia we'll actually go for an aerodrome. Which will enable us to uh, <coughs> construct the Boeing B-17 bombers too. And in Palembang we'll go for an airstrip. Casablanca we'll go for an airstrip. New York, we'll go for a sandbag wall. And we're done with the recruitment. In Panama, we'll go for some um, Chester ships, I believe. In Jacksonville, could actually go for some great trips and Iowa battleship Iowa New Orleans and New Mexico okay in Chicago we are constructing rifleman Mataram Casablanca will go for some riflemen Reykjavik will go for some uh, grenadiers. Maybe not, we'll go for Chester ship. And we're done. Let's uh, end the turn. <coughs> Rioting in Hollandia. That's not good. Destroy the Japanese port. Governor's Villa, Japanese, that's not good. <coughs> Let's see here. Small park, stables. Strange. Public health bonus. Rioting in Holland, yeah. End of turn report. Okay, a candidate for adoption. And a factor Franklin Roosevelt. Sure. Remove him. Report. We have some sandbag walls to construct it and dockyards on the land clearance. Okay, diplomatic information. The following factions are now at war with each other. League of Nations, French Republic and the British Commonwealth have declared war on the People's Republic of China. So when we declare war, they declare war. That's good. Loyal allies. Recruitment report. So we 
want to attack the Japanese. Wherever they are. Right, we'll march the troops here. My lord, sire, orders, orders, my lord, my lord, sire, 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 sire. All right. All the good stuff you can move over. One of the armies. No, we didn't have any artillery. Okay, we will attack anyway. Can't attack this time, so we'll wait one turn. We are attacking Kuala Lumpur, held by the Japanese. They have a unit of cavalry there, and a unit, a zero unit, zero fighter unit. And Renault Utsu's tanks. Renault Utsu tanks and zero fighter planes. Okay. Um, couldn't move this unit anymore this time. Can we move the agents? Yes, my lord. No. Let's move them down here. League of Nations is down there. Yes, sire. Let's move down towards Shia yes, and speak to them. Tomorrow's journey planned out. You can also move the spy to How South America. Say? Yes. Are we break then? Then go back to Africa. Move the diplomat there. Sire. Speak to the free the French. Dignitary, sire. Ah, nothing to do there. And let's continue. Yes, Push sire. the Middle East. Yes, sire. Ah, we can't really move into the Middle East. I see we need ships. A Nazi fleet outside and a huge U boat, boat fleet. Yes, sir. Now we run straight into the French state which you hear. We are not at war with them. Okay. And uh, check the constructions. We we'll go for a brick wall in New York. In Jacksonville, we will uh, go 
for an airstrip. Chicago will go for a brick wall as well. And Dallas will go for an airstrip. And then where will go for an airstrip? And in Las Vegas will also go for an airstrip. Most important thing is to have planes. Okay, uh, we'll go for a brick wall in Los Angeles. And an airstrip in Seattle. Okay, and a sandbag wall in Boston. And we're done at the recruitment. Go back to Washington. Okay, we'll go for a uh, Chester ship in Panama. Rifleman are worthless anyway. <coughs> okay, and in. Uh, you missed one area there. We'll go for Corsair fighters in uh, Oneara. Rifleman in Matram, as we couldn't get anything else. In Palembang, we'll go for. Uh, Chester Frips and then Casablanca. I think we can go for the Iowa there. No, we will build up our army in the city instead. And in Reykjavik, we'll go for a Chester. Alright. I think we're done. Okay, let's end turn. Right, in Hollandia, new general in New York. No, in Reykjavik, okay. Can't easily move him right now. End of turn report, same as before, probably. Faction announcement, construction report, we have some sandbag walls, airstrips, barracks. Diplomatic information. The following factions have declared their allies, the Chinese Republic and the People's Republic of China, Chinese Republic and, the po and Portugal, Romania and Hungary. The following factions have declared a ceasefire, People's Republic of China and the French Republic, the United States of America and the British Commonwealth of Nations. Hungary and Third Reich. Okay. Today we're at war. Recruitment report. We have some new troops. And uh, can move the agents first. So yes, we can't friend. move the diplomat into the Middle East. The Middle East because the you're located. We need to avoid the enemy fleets all over the place. So the next time we will be able to board a ship with the diplomat and then we'll send him to the Middle East so we can speak to... No, we'll send him to Turkey so we can speak to Turkey. Okay. Uh, but for now, we can move the diplomat to this on his way to shield Your us. Man. Yes, sire. Yes, sire. Yes. All right. We didn't Tomorrow reach um, Chile that time. That time. Okay. We will move uh, over here. Spy. And uh, the British fleet is blockading the port of. 
Kuala Lumpur held by the Japanese Empire, or the Empire of Japan. Uh, so we can attack. <coughs> I believe uh, so they have planes, tanks, and cavalry. Then it's better if we send in the better army. We will control the infantry then. Okay, we forgot to build a siege track. Okay, then I think uh, we'll wait another turn. We don't need to attack this time. So we need to construct and build stuff. But I think this will be it for now. I will save the game here. another time uh, so if I do <coughs> restart the game I don't think our tanks will be affected because they haven't been in battle okay so see ya the next time bye